We use this data as an example of exponential decay. It is the radioactive count n as a function of time t. And we wish to fit an exponential curve to this data. So we will use analyze, regression, and we wish to fit a nonlinear curve. The dependent variable is n, and we have to enter the theoretical expression. We can do this either by entering it by hand, which we will do, or we can select examples from these function groups. But I will enter the expression and I will introduce the constant a multiplied by the exponential open brackets and then constant b multiplied by the time t. So our expression is that the count rate n equals a a constant times exponential b t. And we must define the starting values for these parameters. So here we'll enter parameters, the name a, and we will give it a starting value of 50 and add. The other parameter is b, and we will give it a starting value of minus 0 0.5 and add that continue. So SPSS will use an iterative method to change the values of a and b to get the best fit exponential expression that fits the data that we have. So we click OK and here we see the iteration history. So the iteration actually goes through 10 steps starting with the initial values of a is 50 and b is minus 0 0.5 to get a best fit result with a value of a equal 97.86 and b equal to minus 0 0.476.